what's good y'all boys and girls it's your one and only sauce money b brian and b bryce and welcome to Bruvy club gaming and today i'm gonna teach y'all boys and girls how to make a Giannis antetokounmpo like build for your my player so first thing what you guys gotta do is put his position as a power forward Giannis official height is 611 his official weight is 242 pounds and his official wingspan is a 7-3 wingspan so as we look to our right and look at the attributes the ratings uh, a, a 80 driving layup uh, a, a 78 driving dunk you know um ball handles pretty low uh it's just not it's not it's not it's no we can't <laughs> we just can't work with this you know it's just it is it's workable but we just cannot work with it bro it's we can't work with a 611 Giannis build and in the past i always did like a 610 Giannis, and let's see what happens when we put it at 610 when we put it at 610 our driving dunk look look our driving dunk go up by seven seven and our layup our layup go up by like uh four which is good and then our ball handle goes to a 70 but it's gonna go down because i'm planning to max out the wingspan and you know um when you max out the wingspan check this out all the way up to seven eight your driving dunk goes from a 85 to a 94 now that sounds more like a Giannis Antetokounmpo build you know a 94 driving dunk that sounds scary with a, a 95 standing dunk that's that's pretty much insane yes our blocking is already at a like the highest it can go but yo seven eight wingspan sounds crazier to me in my opinion and look what it does to the driving dunk it does justice to it so this is the body settings that i recommend for Giannis. uh body shape you guys can go with whatever body shape you guys want to i'm gonna just go solid for Giannis. now we're gonna continue on to setting the potential for this my player all right first thing we're gonna do we're gonna go all the way down to the physicals we're gonna put the stamina all the way up to uh 91 next we're gonna max out our acceleration to 67 then we're gonna go all the way up back to finishing we're gonna max out driving dunk and when you max it out to a 94 it brings up your vertical so your vertical is at a 69 and it brings up your driving layup which is at a 69 as well but we're gonna max out the driving layup all the way to 84 because you know his his driving layup is really good in um this actual 2k 2k game and it's actually higher than 84 but we can't go any higher but fortunately enough like once we go 84 we get hall of fame pro touch and this guy is a really good finisher so hall of fame pro touch with a gold acrobat you're gonna be going crazy laying up the ball now the standing dunk we're gonna max out standing dunk and that's where we're gonna get most of our finishing badges from and then on the post control we're gonna put it up to try to at least get 20 let's see we're going all the way up to 67 we're going to go all the way up to 67 on purpose because if we don't go to 67 we're not going to get the Giannis comparison so this is why we went 67 instead of like taking a few away and just leaving it at 61 to get 20 so put it at 67 for the shooting we're going to touch the shooting later now for playmaking we're going to max out speed with ball first and that brings up our speed to 35 and that gives us a gold downhill which is a great badge for a Giannis build then we're gonna max out our ball handling and that gives us two potential badge points and then for pass accuracy we're we're actually gonna have to put this up because if we do not put it up we're not gonna get the honest uh comparison and we need a little bit like we need like at least six so we can get downhill on gold and then um let me see what else we can get we have to put this all the way up to 67 oh no is that 66 yeah we have to put it at 67 so we can have a gold dimer and um a gold um downhill but you probably would even need dimer some of you guys might use bailout or some of you guys might use uh what badge is that break starter so it's yeah it's really up to you guys some of you guys might use unpluckable i don't know you have six badge points for the playmaking which is good that can give you two gold badges now for defense interior defense we're maxing it out to 94 and look at the badges it gives us defensive leader hall of fame uh post lockdown hall of fame um what is that i think tireless defender i think that's that badge you have brick wall hall of fame 
and what are these other badges oh my bad it clutch defender hall of fame you have hot stopper hall of fame and yeah and you have tireless defender yeah hall of fame so after that you have to also max out perimeter defense for uh to get the Giannis comparison because Giannis has a high perimeter defense and that gives you hall of fame off ball pest which is uh <laughs> it's an annoying badge i'm not gonna lie if somebody had off ball pests and i like it was guarding me and i'm trying to get open off ball like bro that thing is annoying and then you have hall of fame trapper you have gold pick dodger so you have a lot of good uh perimeter badges next what we're gonna do we're gonna skip the steel because steel is too expensive it's too expensive guys so we're gonna actually go to block we're gonna put the block all the way up to 89 and i really wanted to get it to like um 90 i wanted to get it to a 94 so we can get hall of fame intimidator and i like that badge a lot and then you can get like uh you can get like hall of fame pogo stick but it's not gonna give us a Giannis comparison so i i, I couldn't do that i had to leave his block at 89 after that we go to offensive rebounding and we go all the way up to 89 and that's going to give us that's gonna give us 17 badge points to put in on your uh, defensive badges and that's pretty much where our rebounding badges are gonna come from of course we're gonna put defensive rebounding all the way up maxed out to uh all the way up maxed out to 95 so we can get 26 potential badge points and you have a variety of defensive badges you guys could use for this Giannis build 26 is really good with 26 badge points you could get six hall of fame badges now that's that's op next what we're gonna do we're gonna max out our speed all the way up to 71 and then um strength we could put the strength at we could put our strength at 71 and we could put our vertical at 71 and then we still have points to spend we still have points to spend and check this out we're gonna spend it on the shooting 78 three-point shot and an 81 mid-range shot and then we're gonna put one on free throw which gives us six potential badge points on the shooting Giannis only have a 73 three-point shot in nba 2k 21 next gen so having a 78 three-point shot rating you already can shoot better than Giannis. unfortunately we don't have a higher mid-range shot it's just by one rating off his his uh mid-range shot is a 82 and this one is a 81 but of course when we hit 99 overall it's gonna go up so we have in total 58 badge points you're gonna be really good on defense you could shoot you know like you're not gonna be shooting like crazy but 78 three-point shot with an 81 mid-range shot like you can shoot decently like i'm not gonna lie you can shoot decently with a fire jump shot and the right badges you can make your open shots now the finishing you're just a monster on finishing so you're a monster on finishing and a monster on defense the physicals i know it doesn't do the actual Giannis justice neither does Giannis ball handling on this build does him justice his actual ball handling rating in 2k is a 87 and his speed with ball is a 80 and his pass accuracy is a 84 and his perimeter defense is actually higher than his interior defense he has a 95 perimeter defense in the game and an 87 interior defense he has a 68 block so at least we have a higher block than Giannis his offensive rebounding is a 79 so we have a higher offensive rebounding his defensive rebounding is a uh, 97 so we we can pass 97 once we hit 99 overall but yeah the physicals is just like what's like blowing this build a little bit like yo you just can't you just can't like it's impossible with the 2k my player builder to create an exact build but it, it got better over the years i'm not gonna lie this next gen is like you most definitely can make a demigod but with the physicals for like big people that have 90 speed like Giannis, not Giannis has a 90 speed 87 acceleration 90 strength a 85 vertical you know so it's like we're not gonna get that because that would be too OP, bro. That's literally Giannis on the court. But, you know, this this was the best I could do, y'all boys. I ain't gonna lie. But, in my opinion, I think this build is still pretty fire. All right, so now we're gonna continue to putting TakeOver. I think Giannis TakeOver has to be... I don't know. I think, I think glass cleaning or slashing. Or like, I don't know. I'm not too sure. 
I'm not really too sure. You guys could pick whatever you guys want. You guys could do box out wall or see the future or glad you know you guys could do that um i'm mostly gonna go with something crazy like easy blow buys that's gonna be op because the honest dude would be just blowing by and plus we don't have a crazy speed or acceleration like that so easy blow buys should help i think i'm gonna just go with see the future as the the second one the second takeover we're just gonna continue and now here we have you have built Paint Beast, Shades of, number one option, Giannis Antetokounmpo. And that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like. It takes a lot of work to do these type of videos. A lot of thinking, a lot of research, and a lot of trial and error and, you know, math and stuff like that. So, y'all y'all show love. Also, I'll uh, leave another suggestion on which build you guys think I should do next. I got like plenty of builds and I want to get a lot of builds out and like, you know, head off to doing like park videos because my homeboy is getting the P5 soon. So I want to do park videos and I want to do like my league videos. Yeah, I want to do videos like KOT4Q. Like, I, like his my league videos are pretty cool. And I want to do like simulation videos, like click productions and stuff. So that would be pretty fun. I'm going to try to push out a lot of popular build videos and then, um, you know, if you guys really want me to keep making build videos, y'all just let me know in the comments. I'm going to try to like, I'm going to try to get through a lot before I move on to a different genre of 2K. Merch coming soon. Broovy Club, I'm signing out. Thank you for everything. Broovy gang. Broovy.